the roller coaster weather we've had so far is bad news for anyone who enjoys being out on the ice this winter. Here's our view from Sky 11 of Lake Minnetonka today. From too much snow to snow melt to rain and refreezing, that combination means some winter staples in Minnesota are ending early. Devon Roming has the warning from Water Patrol that sent some ice fishermen scrambling. Some of the issue spots that we're seeing are Black Lake, Seton Lake, and Emerald Lake, as well as Carson's Bay. Our unseasonably warm winter is causing problems for those trying to enjoy the great outdoors on area lakes. Over the last week, we've had a few incidents of uh, snowmobiles and ATVs going through. Images of ice houses stuck on Lake Minnetonka now serving as a warning from the Hennepin County Water Patrol, reeling in concern about getting trapped for ice fishermen like Jim Gray. Just a good idea to move it out and let it freeze again and we can always move it back. From warmer temps to rain showers, several factors are at play, according to CARE 11 meteorologist Ben Deary. All the snow that we got earlier this year helped to insulate the ice, so that prevented it from growing to a really safe level. Safety is key for those brave enough in times like these. You should always have some type of flotation device with you. You should have ice picks and you should drive carefully when you're on the lake and have your windows down in case there is an incident and your vehicle does go into the water. While it may feel like winter is nearing its end, there's still hope for a sense of seasonal normalcy with more sub-zero days to come. Yes, we are still in the middle of winter and I would expect to see winter conditions at least over the next few weeks. The Sheriff's Office says if you have to be rescued from a lake where one of these thin ice warning signs is posted, you can actually be fined and ask for an amount. Well, that would be left up to a district court judge to decide. In Hennepin County, Devon Roming, CARE 11 News.